Knowledge, come with me. We must witness this together. Forsyth? You're afraid. We all are. No. I am just sad that it has come to this. Shall we begin? Hello, friend. <laughs> we didn't mean to startle you. Your bravery and creativity inspired us to seek your aid. You see, our world is under attack. It's being devoured. And it is a danger only you can prevent. Time is of the essence. Will you help us? Thank you. Now step forward, brave hero. And join us. Hang on to your stomach. This will just take a second. Welcome. I'm afraid we have much to ask of you. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Minecraft Legends. I have seen the trailer for this game, but I had not seen the part where it actually transitioned into an actual Minecraft world. Like you are being brought into this different, almost, well, different world. <laughs> I don't have much to say in this intro other than I am excited. This is the hero, this is us right here. And we're just gonna go ahead and make a new story. We're just gonna jump into it and I'll see you back with the three knowledge, action, fate. Yep, that's gonna take some getting used to. I'm back with names. <laughs> But let's just jump into this. Hello! I hope you're feeling okay. That kind of trip always upsets my stomach. <laughs> Thank you for having the courage to come. I am Foresight. I'm Action. And I'm Knowledge. I wish we had met under different circumstances, but this world is under attack. And we need your help. Foul creatures known as the Piglins have emerged from their fiery home. And they mean to conquer this peaceful land and all the creatures that live here. We need your help to make sure that doesn't happen. But don't worry, you won't be alone. Behold, I always wanted to say that. <laughs> we present to you... Gifts! <laughs> With the right melodies from this loot, the LAs will gather your resources, keep them safe for you, and build whatever you need. 
Within this case burn the flames of creation. The flames will call upon friends to fight by your side. These golems helped us shape the overworld, and now they will help you defend it. And last but not least, this is the banner of courage. Raise it high, and this world will rise to your aid. The piglins' hunger is insatiable. They already have a foothold in the overworld. And if they are not stopped, they will devour everything. We didn't prepare the creatures of our world for this day. But we believe you can. That's why we called upon you. If there is any hope, it's you. Hello? <laughs> Calm I don't down, have time, but just enough to show you a thing or two about these tools. Oh, we're being brought into a tutorial no realm? Maybe? Looks like it. So the sooner you master these tools, the better. Oh, there we are Head with the horse. We'll get started. That's us. Can we zoom in? Doesn't look like it. But... We can look around when you steer it with the... You can steer it with the camera and also WASD. That's awesome. I think I need to lower my mouse sensitivity. <laughs> but here we go. Lots of graphics. Great. Now let's get to work. Let's. The overworld is filled with resources you can gather to help you fight the piglins. And that's where the LAs come in. Play the right melody on your loot and they'll gather anything for you. Let's start by playing the melody to gather wood. Okay. Gathering resources. Gather 60 wood from the trees nearby. Hold to enter build view. That's this one. And move until the gather zone shows up. So let's cover both these trees. Actually, let's cover these two corner trees right here. Press to confirm the placement of the gather melody. Oh, so it's like we're placing a music box, basically. And there they spawn. And then they start gathering the wood. That's very useful. Make your way to where action is and use your loot to gather some stone. Alright, so they are just going to gather wood straight off the bat. And then we nice can work. we can go ahead and this time play the melody for gathering stone. So select gather stone on the hot bar. Oh, so we can set it select it like that. That's cool. Let's place one there. There we go. So we can select it down here in our now hot bar basically. That's step one. Step two is playing the melody that will inspire the LAs to build what you need. Hey, build some stairs so you can come and join me up here. Ooh. Reach action with a ramp. Press C to navigate to the building hotbar. Oh, so they're down there. So Z for gathering, X for fighting, I suppose, C for building. And then we can select multiple things here. So holding right click and then hold to enter build view. Press the start placement, drag the ramp up to action. I guess we could drag it from up here as well. I guess that could work. You know the yeah. platforms the LA's built can be used as stairs too. It just depends on how you look at it. And we could remove it as well if we wanted to. Okay, that's cool. Well done. Thank you. Stairs are going to save you a lot of time out there. You'll use flames of creation to call your friends to battle. Lapis will keep these flames burning bright. Take some from that chest to play a spawner melody. Ooh. Open the chest near action. Q hold Q to open the chest when standing near it. Ah, okay. Let's light those flames. Use the spawner melodies to call the golems you met earlier. Okay, so that will be V, I assume. Nope, X. Build a golem spawner. Press X to select the hotbar, and then we can select a spawner. Hold, press to confirm the placement of a spawner. Let's spawn a cobblestone spawner. There we go, and the LA's are going to build it. That's cool. Oh, great! Each spawner holds the flames of creation that will call upon your allies. Call them. Call your allies. Okay, spawn three golems. Hold Q to spawn golems while standing near the spawner. Each spawn mob takes up a flame of creation. So we have space for 20 right now. Uh, so we can recall, remove, or spawn. I'm gonna hold down. Nice. There we go. So now we have four. I guess we could the keep. Are new to battle, but oh, we need 
We need lapis Use and the stone. Of courage to bring your friends over to me. Banner of courage. Uh, Q quickly press to nearby golems to follow you. Ah, okay. So not holding it down, but just pressing it lightly. Or quickly. <laughs> not holding Press it down, them. basically. If you want the golems to stop following you, use your banner again to ask them to stop. And hold Q to stop your golems from following you. Nicely done. Okay. There you go. You can also use the banner to send your friends in any direction you want. Send them over to action. Okay. Press the send nearby gong. So if I... Okay, so if I... Oh, so where I look, basically, they're going to go. I can't hold it down to see where. So if I do this, and then do that. Okay. Hello, little friends. Nice. The idea of piglins inside the Well of Fate is terrible. So we've created some false piglins so you can practice using the banner in combat. Ooh, okay. Destroy the piglin uh, pits. Press to rally your golems to the piglins. Press to direct your golems to destroy the pits. Press to attack piglins with your sword. Okay. So, to battle, I suppose. I guess they're going to automatically do that. I can defend them while they are destroying that. Attack that. Okay, you just gotta get the hang of it, but as soon as you do, it's actually working very well. Now take everything you've learned here into the real fight, and the piglins won't stand a chance. It is good that you are ready, as I must ask we get moving. Yes, let's get moving then. No time to waste. Thank you again for your courage. We are honored to have you as an ally. We'll be with you every step of the way. Whoa, calm down, horse. <laughs> Didn't get to say my goodbyes or anything. Well, I guess they're gonna, like they said, gonna be there all the way. But let's enter the world of Minecraft Legends and save it from these horrible, horrible piglins. <laughs> And we are through the portal and are met with villagers, cats, ocelots, pigs, llamas. I guess everyone is here to... Oh. Isn't that cat, like, rideable, I'm pretty sure? And we are... Oh. And we are Welcome here. Welcome to our world. We would love to introduce you properly, but a village needs your help. Oh. Please, go to them. I will. A compass and a map. Use them to make sure you're going in the right direction. Okay, so I can press reach the village that is under attack. So M opens up the world. This looks to be the world. We can zoom in. This is the village. I can place a marker. If I want to recenter. We provided you with some okay. starting resources, but remember that the LAs can gather more for you while you make your way. Okay. Busy LAs or happy LAs. Okay, so. I've already forgotten how to do that. <laughs> pretty sure, yes, I'm already on C. Okay, so I'm pretty sure, yep, we're going in this direction. I hope the horse can actually swim. Oh, but we can jump far, that's good, that's good. You found a new resource. Where? Okay, but let's gather some, let's immediately gather some wood. Right here, let's also gather some stone. Because we're going to be needing it. So let's do that. So we already have 260 wood, 260 stone, almost at 50 lapis. Let's ride with haste. I don't know how many uh, LAs we could actually, like, summon in. But I mean... Let's just pop down a cobble when we come across, like, wood and stuff like that. Let's do that. I think that might be the max that we can actually actually do. But the world is amazingly pretty. Like, I really love that. And it's raining! It's raining now! Look at the puddles! I love this. I love this. I just gotta get used to the controls. Hey, turtle! I'm not gonna bring the turtle into battle. That... That... <laughs> that wouldn't work. Oh, is this... What's this? Redstone? 
I don't think I can gather this. I don't think I can gather this, at least not yet. Please hurry. The piglins are relentless. Alright. Hurrying. Are these blue portals over here? I don't know what they actually do. Yeah, it looks like there is redstone in this uh, in this area. At least it looks like redstone. I would assume that this is uh, redstone. Don't know what these things are. But let's just keep going, get to that village. Run through the tall grass so we can get a speed boost. Let's get out of this forest. Oh, I see the village. This looks like coal. That's the village. Yes. Get over there quickly. Okay. <gasps> oh no. Oh dear. That's a landless. Poor fox. Poor villagers. <laughs> well, that's why we're here. We're going to save them. They've been captured. That's what you get. <laughs> okay, so we need to defeat Those twenty pink monsters. Must be stopped. I think I'm able to just. I could summon in. Quickly, quickly! You have to get rid of all the piglins. I could summon in spawners, but can't I just? I would think I can. by the piglins Ooh. can be used to fuel your spawners. Collect the lapis to keep your fires burning. Don't forget, build spawners to summon allies to fight by your side. Okay, I'm gonna do that real quick. I have 20 flames, so I'm going to spawn in 5 here, I think. Or 7. Let's do 7. Like that. Quickly gather them. And they're going to attack them on their own. They're going to open the cage. And these guys will shoot any piglins that are getting near us. Pretty good stuff. Let's open the next cage. And I can fight as well, of course. Very good stuff. Get rid of that one. Oh, don't you dare. Get rid of that one. Good job. Where's the, where, where's the rest? Over here. Cover me. And mission accomplished. Look at us. Yahoo! Victorious. Eh? That doesn't look good. That doesn't look good at all. The immediate danger is over. But the village is devastated. The piglins have ruined the fountain. A carpenter hut will repair nearby structures. Get the LAs to work building one for you. Ooh. Okay. Let us build that. Uh, press E to select the building to find the little carpenter but near the beam of light. Okay, so just near this thing then. Right there should do the trick. I, I kind of place that. You know what? It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> But so this should make it so that this is going to be repaired as soon as it's done building. And now the repair is underway, I'm pretty sure, as it says 1%. Nice. What a relief. The water flows again. Perfect. 5% uh, the piglins are mounting an attack on another village. Oh no! There is no time to waste. The villagers need you. Okay, let's take a look at the map. Looks like this we are village going. Is under attack. Go to them. We shall. Let's go. I don't know if my minions will be able to follow me this far, but I will run as fast as possible. What is an R? Ooh, so that's resources. That's combat melody, so I assume we can get more and then we can customize our hotbars to hold the stuff that we actually are using. Okay, cool. Definitely want to gather the rest of this stuff if that's possible at some point. I don't know when we actually get that though. 
But I'm really enjoying the, the view. Oh, that's water. Ugh. There we go. Remember, your map and compass will show you the way. I'm really, really enjoying the view, though. Like, the graphics are amazing. Oh, ow, ow. Sorry, sorry, guys. That <laughs> I'm enjoying the view. Red thorn, apparently, is, that, is what that plant is. Oh. Okay. Not ideal. I don't want to die right now. That would be not ideal. Let's keep running here. Let's go around the nasty thorned plants. Ooh, here's the village. Okay. <laughs> I keep looking in the distance, like at the view and whatnot. I don't look what's right in front of me. Right, well, here's the village that is under, a th under threat. More images in the well. Is it our hero? Another village, it seems. And more piglins. Not again. Should we go warn them? As much as it hurts our hearts to see this happen, we must trust that our hero will see them through it. Sounds like I might be left to do this on my own this time, without help. Oh no. Alright. We have to do this. Uh, I'm going to spawn cobblestone golems here immediately. I'm going to call in like seven of those as well. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Let's just do that. All of you with me. Defend the village at all costs. I love how I'm on a horse and just ride through the entire army. <laughs> just doing a bunch of damage. I'm on fire though. You have to defeat the piglins attacking the village. We can't allow them to gain any ground. I wonder if I can upgrade like my own weapons and tools and whatnot. Okay, there's four more that has to be defeated. Looks like that has been done. We are efficient at this. The piglins are gone. We thank you. And the villagers want to thank you too. Go to the village chest at the base of the fountain for a surprise. Ooh. Open chest. Don't mind if I do. What do we get? The villagers are peaceful but want to help where they can. As gratitude, you can count on their resourcefulness to keep you in the fight. They'll keep gathering materials for you while you're out saving the day. The piglins are rallying on the outskirts of the village. I think another attack is on the way. Better Where? build up some defenses while there's still time. Okay, so if I go to C, Arrow Tower. Arrow Towers will work well to defend this village. I don't know where to place one, but I'm gonna... P I don't know where, like, they're going to attack from. I'm not sure where they're going to attack from, so I guess I'll place one maybe here. I guess one in each like corner. Like that. You need to get some defenses up around the village. Maybe place one here as well. And then one out here. Okay, and then we can use Place the arrow towers already. Maybe it's not done building yet. Got that one. There's still some time to gather up resources if you're getting low, but be quick. I wonder how well does a wall work? Place standing piece. Okay, so we could put a wall all the way around the village. I don't know how effective that'll be. Maybe they want another tower closer to this. The piglins are close. Don't forget, your golem friends want to help too. Let's try and place one here as well. Just keep it keeps the arrow on They're almost the tower. Here. Oh, I can't watch this. Let's try and place a wall right here. Just to see how this mechanic actually works. The piglins are here. Brace yourself, hero. I want to use all my materials. Oh, looks like I just had time. More piglins approaching. Well, we have five battle towers uh, in position. The piglins will attack from all sides, so be sure to check your compass to see where they're coming from. 
Okay, so the compass is at the top, so they are attacking from this side. They're at of course it's by my spawner. <laughs> of course it's by my spawner. Alright, well. Looks like the wave will last for two minutes straight. But we are doing well. Let us move to this side over here. With our army, this should be a fairly easy task. I want to see this tower do some damage as well. Okay. Not bad. Not bad at all. Okay, that's fire damage. I can take it though. I can take it. Man, they, they have no chance. They have no chance with us. No chance whatsoever. They should, they should just give up, really. You're doing great. Just a little longer and you've got this. Yeah, I thought it would happen over here. More piglins! Gonna take actually let's let let them come to us. I assume I could position like these guys strategically as well. I guess I could just send them to battle like that and go do something else as well. That's pretty cool. I really love the the real-time strategy part of it as well. They're attacking the llamas? Wow. Okay. <gasps> it's the piglins! Oh, Hurry, the again. villagers need your help right now! Thing. Nope, they're spawning over here as well. Quickly. I think we have the tower here. I have a pretty decent area of effect as well, or area damage. Be gone. And I think that that is the wave completed. The attack is over, but some piglins remain. Uh, where would that be? Where are they hiding? Where are they hiding? Oh! Well, that makes sense. Done. This is village is saved again <laughs> for the second time today. You've done it! <laughs> village saved! We knew you'd do it. The Invasion repelled. that you defended their fountain. They've put some extra resources in the chest for you as a special thank you. You are doing well. The piglins do not give up easily. Even now, they prepare an attack upon another of our villages. Oh dear. But this time we have the advantage. If you can shut down the piglin outpost surrounding the village, we might be able to push back this invasion. That is exactly what we will do. Let's see what we got for this. Oh. Okay, well that... Resource... Limit, apparently. Okay. Well, destroy the piglin outposts. I guess I'll have to come back for this at some point. Right, so our current task is to defeat these three piglin outposts to save this specific village. Alright, so I suppose if we go over here, then we should be able to attack it straight on. I just want to see, what is this? I don't know what this is. By the way, if you guys have any tips or suggestions, don't hesitate to let me know down below in the comments. And also, if you are enjoying the video, be sure to leave it a like and let me know down below in the comments if you want to see an episode 2. Because right now, I'm really enjoying this game, not gonna lie. Alright, we are going to race to the other side, use the tall grass. That's thorns. Actually gonna be good to get out of this, um, this desert. Less thorns will be nice. I love the world generation though. Whoop! Alright, so I placed the marker over here, a little bit away from the first outpost. I feel ready to do this, I think. It's nighttime as well, gotta love it. Uh, where are we going? How close are we? Okay, about half. About halfway. Whee! 
Oh, I have special jump boost. Oh, wow. Oh, those are the mushrooms. The red mushrooms. I remember now from uh, the minecart event. That's cool. Whee! And with the tall grass, we can run faster as well. That's cool. That way you don't... See, let's rest on again. Let's rest on again. I really want to get that. But yeah, like I was saying, that way you don't waste too much time exploring. Or not exploring, but like traveling from place to place. Oh, and a sun, sunrise already. Very nice. More redstone again. I'm pretty sure I've seen redstone and coal so far. We have a 200... 50 lapis though. That's not bad. Okay, we're getting close. I feel like that we're getting close. That attack could happen any moment now. You have to go after the new piglin outposts. I'm working on it. I see it. Oh, I see it in the background. I see it in the distance. I definitely see it in the distance. Right. Question is, uh, I have two more slots. I could use some more... I suppose I could use some more archers. So let's just make a quick spawner here. I need to remember to generate resources as well. But let's spawn one more archer, two more archers. There we go. Now we're full. Let's get everyone to follow. And... Probably going to tell them to attack. I hate attack. Some engineering, but those Blazewood Towers are pretty dangerous. And their range is impressive. Mm. The LAs will help you get up there with a ramp. All you have to do is play the right melody. Oh, ramp. Okay, so I'm gonna have to make a ramp. Uh, probably over here somewhere. I'm just kind of running on the outskirts, checking out the area. We have two... Uh, these towers are covering a pretty decent area. Oh, okay, yep, they, they're basically like my towers. Alright, well, we're just wasting time running around, I suppose. Cobblestone golems are great at smashing buildings. Plant golems are good against... Piglins. Okay, well, we are going... Oh, I can build it from all the way over here. Okay, now that's very useful. Alright, let's build a staircase over. Confirm. So the allies will build that. I'm going to tell them to attack this. I'll cover them. So the stone golems attack the buildings. I'm going to try and attack these guys over here. I think I'm actually gonna go ahead and take these guys and attack this. You fellas, attack this tower. Get rid of the tower, I'll cover them from the other things. As soon as these guys are done, we need to get rid of this building right here. Attack. These guys are just doing their own, kind of doing their own thing. I like that. Come on, fellas. This lonely guy just standing there. Oh, he's found in. And no more. Victory! But there are more piglins out there. There's no time to waste. Oh, I was about to gather my reso my my troops, but <laughs> okay. Oh, hello. Normally, I really wouldn't like you guys, but if you want to help, <laughs> interesting. <laughs> the world is waking to the war. Where will this lead? I mean, creepers as allies. Just saying. That would be kind of cool. Right, well. Here's my army. That was one piglin outpost. I have to remember that. And those what? Oh, it says what kind of ores we can find. Oh, that's neat. What's this? I'm curious. What could this be? I am very curious. But we do have two more outposts that needs destroying. So, I will gather the troops. Because this place has been cleared. 
And it looks like we need to go in this direction. It looks like we lost one, but... I mean, we have been through quite a few battles now. Which I think, all things considered, but that's not too bad. I can't wait to unlock more building things and more spawning things and gathering stuff. Uh, suppose... Oh, no resources to gather. Okay, I wanted to get the trees, but that's fine. <laughs> I guess I can chop some of this, maybe? No. Oh, yeah, that looks like maybe dirt, actually. Oh, that's an outpost. Ow, 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 ow. Ow. Didn't see that. Uh, right, well. We have this, which, uh, is surrounded by lava. Lava? Here? We clearly underestimated their capacity for corruption. Remember the ramps you built with us at the well? They don't only have to go up. RCLA is to build you a bridge across that moat. Will do. Sounds like a great idea. Drag it all the way over. Just make it nice and neat. Okay, well. I wish there was a way when I had a group to, like, select all of them. Okay, well, let's go. Break through this. Oh, look at the columns doing their thing. I love that animation. I don't know if I can do anything with this. Or if I just have to wait for the gates to fall. There's a lot of them on the other side, though. This is a bit worrying. Come on. Break it down, fellas. Break it down. It's almost down. The there we There's go. Well... Except for a few piglins, yeah, no kidding. Well, yet again, we haven't lost anyone yet. Attack. This. Attack! Get rid of that thing ASAP. I will cover you, fellas. They just focus on the building. I'll focus on the... Oh, don't fall in the lava, folks. I assume these two buildings are the main ones that we need to get rid of and not the entire wall. But either way, that works. Uh-oh. Done! Oh, yep, the walls fell. Awesome. Very good. There is still one more outpost, however. Yes, and that needs to be taken care of. Destroy the final piglin outpost. Let's quickly make a bridge first, though. Because I don't really want to get into lava. That would be not good. All right, fellas, this way. We still have 19 out of 20. We didn't lose anyone in that battle. So that is pretty good. Uh, in this direction, I assume it's going to be close. Whee! Absolutely love the, the graphics of this. Oh, the wolves. Can I? I don't know if I can hire the wolves. Oh, I can. Some of them, at least. Oh, but then... Oh no, it looks like all of them are following me. Oh, that's cool. That's awesome. So you can actually use the animals in the world to fight with you. Yeah, the spreaders. Ugh. The pollution they create makes the air breathable for the piglins. Oh dear. Yeah, that needs to be taken care of immediately. Uh, right, well... No two ways about it. Attack. They focus on the buildings again. I will focus on the piglins together with the wolves. Oh dear. This is doing quite a bit of damage actually, these. The 
attack this. There's another, another spreading first call. Because they do area damage, it seems. <laughs> oh, I thought this one was done. Hello. This is the final outpost, though, then. Okay, let's gather these guys up. Need to get rid of this first. Or that, I suppose. This is going well. And there we go. Beautiful. Good stuff. Destroying those nether spreaders will help clear the air. Nicely done. Ah, our curious creeper is back. And they brought a friend. Oh, they look happy. Do? We will find out soon enough. I mean, if they want to help in the fight, I won't I'll mind one bit. All those outposts. You've collected quite a bit of prismarine. Bring it to me at the will of fate, and I'll show you how to build something that will be very useful for you. You are attuned to the waters of the well. You can travel here quickly, anytime you wish. So we can use fast travel on the map to get there instantly. That's the village. Oh, so I can fast travel. Okay. That's cool. Well, I can't... Yeah, I suppose we can fast travel. Uh, okay, let's fast travel. Let's fast travel to the well of fate. Boom. Knowledge? What are you doing out there? I'm working on a little something extra to help the hero. Ah. What do you think? <laughs> they are perfect. They won't be as friendly with the piglins, I assure you that. Okay, okay, go on now. Join your new friends. You two, little one, go on. Looks like we got some new troops. The mossy and grindstone golems are excited to join you, but you'll need a special resource to build them. I've written the melody for you. You'll just need to build the right improvements. All right. Open your songbook, add the improvement, gather iron to your melody's Very hotbar. Nice. This is where all the wonderful melodies you learn will be kept. Now go ahead and turn the pages. Okay. There you go. Now choose the structure that improves your loot to play the iron melody. And the LA's will build it for you. Okay, so I can choose this. Gather iron. Great. Now go ahead and build your iron improvement. Okay. Go to V, Improvement Gather Iron, and I should do this. Build the Improvement Gather Iron in the zone near the Improvement Hubs. That's a well of fate. Oh! So we can generate, generate like this, with this thing. Or do I build it here, or do I build it near it? Near, okay, so near the, the thing. Okay. Let's place it right there. With every new oh, so melody, your okay. relationship with the LA's grows. This tune will help them mine iron for your building needs. And there you have it. Now you'll be able to collect iron in the world and spawn these new friends whenever you need them. Awesome. Oh, there they now are. Now you have access to iron, you can use it to build all sorts of new structures. Structures? Ooh. We got the well house. Are planning something. I know it. The piglins have their eyes on that last village you saved. They're going to need you again. Okay. 
We got another Piglin Outpost, but guys, I think that that is pretty decent for a first episode. We have an army following us. We got new friends that we can spawn. We have new buildings, masonry, well house. Oh, we can gather res- wait, can I, can I build these? Do I have what I need for them? No. Looks like we need maybe some other resource or something. Gather diamond. Gather coal. Yep, we need some other resources for those, it seems. But those are some pretty good stuff. And we can also gather... I probably need to gather iron in order for, to build the structures for them. So guys, I really hope you have, that you have enjoyed this episode. I'm going to call this the first episode here. Again, be sure to leave it a like. If you're new to the channel, be sure to subscribe and let me know if you want to see an episode 2. Because I'm actually really enjoying this game. But yeah, that's gonna be it for this one. Hope you enjoyed and I hope to see you in the next one. Have a wonderful day and until next time, goodbye.